What is going on guys? Kevin over at Legros coming back to you with another video today. Uh, we have $240 worth of stuff. I think it ended up being, uh, looks like the package weighs two pounds, one ounce, so close to two pounds actually. Uh, so almost about 120 bucks a pound. Some cool stuff that I thought I saw in here. So we're gonna take a look and see what it looks like. Looks like it might've been another Lego seller or something like that because they had them in, organized in those Pops Block, Shop, Pops Block Shop yellow trays. Uh, that he made so famous there. So <laughs> if you guys haven't checked him out, go check it out. Uh, anyways, uh, this was $240. If you guys see any of the stuff you like, stores.ebay.com slash legbros, or you can find us on Whatnot quite a bit nowadays. $10 off your first purchase there if you've never purchased anything, and I get $10 as well. Uh, of course, my wife is calling me. Hold on one second. Let me text her. All right, so... I'll call her back after this video is done. Hopefully it doesn't take too long uh, or else I'll be in the doghouse. <laughs> Let's go forward with this. See what we got. looks like mostly superheroes. There is some Star Wars stuff I see in here as well. Uh, so let's just take a look. Let's just take a look. First off, right there. I don't think that's the right uh, <clears throat> outfit for him, uh, but I believe it is the right face. Two-Face, that is a fantastic fig. I don't think they've remade that version of Two-Face, so I'm pretty sure that's the expensive one. Uh, we have the Riddler. That is the wrong hair piece or head piece, I should say. Uh, I don't remember which one that goes to. We do have the Tidarium Han Solo. That's pretty good as well. Put that down in the tank pile right there. We got Batgirl. Uh, this looks like Rachel from Friends. Interesting that that's already torn apart <laughs> like crazy. Tonto did not have a great day today. That's unfortunate. We'll replace some pieces on him. This is a great fig. Martian Manhunter. I don't remember which version it is. This one's fake, though. Yeah, that one's fake. Wah wah. Fake goes up there. Uh, and then we'll put those away later on. Uh, hopefully none of these other stuff is fake. I don't know what that is. Maybe it's a uh, sign. There's like a Seinfeld one. Did they do Seinfeld? It might be George Costanza. I don't remember. Uh, Dick Grayson from Batman. We do have an old school Dragon Knight. Here is a great piece. That is the bow from Green Arrow. We'll keep that down there. And Harley Quinn with a bat. That's always pretty cool. Let's see, Barbara Gordon, I think. I don't remember, we'll put that in research. I don't remember, I know she has some valuable versions. I don't remember if that's the one or not. Uh, this one is Robin. There is a version of Robin with green arms. I don't think this is what it's supposed to look like. I think it's the wrong hair at least. That's gonna go in research as well. Uh, it's been a while. Now that I just do, <laughs> I mostly put stuff on whatnot, I just kind of post it. There's Two-Face without looking at prices and everything. So I'm losing a lot of the pricing that I used to know. Uh, Arkham, some Arkham suits here, a whole bunch of Arkham suits, it looks like, from all sorts of different folks. <laughs> I think there's a couple of figures that you can put heads and bodies on, or heads and, uh, hair on. Uh, that used to be Han Solo legs, but it doesn't look like anymore. Uh, we do have Cyborg. That one's got a crack, unfortunately. We put a new torso on there, no problem. <laughs> That's a super creepy one. We'll just put that over there. Uh, we have Deadshot. This one's pretty cool. Hawkman. Unfortunately, his torso is cracked. Some usable pieces, though on that guy, so we'll put him in the ding pile uh, as well. Sinestro, there is a really good one. That is Poison Ivy. I think she's supposed to have a dress, which is unfortunate she doesn't have that, but that is a solid find right there. I will take that all day. There's Zodiac and something else. Ooh, look at that little piece. Sometimes parts and pieces hauls, Inquisitor armor right there. Hello there. Ooh, there's the other wings for uh, Hawkman. Uh, Starfire, that is a fantastic fig. Looks like that's actually in pretty good condition as well. I don't know why there's some complete and then some not complete. Kind of interesting. Arctic Batman, not bad. That white cape always frays. Oh, look at that. No cracks. Hello. Bausch Leia. We will put that together in no time. Get that thing up and running. That is a solid find right there. Uh, Space Batman, not bad, not bad. Armored Batman, also not bad. There's a whole bunch of Batman capes that I see right here. Uh, we have another Tonto right here. Just needs some hair. Uh, this one is Alfred. I have no idea what hair or hat he's supposed to wear. That's going to go in research. No idea. That could be a good one. I'm not sure. Uh, here's another one of those Tonto hair pieces. Put that on him just so it's in the right spot. Uh, this one's kind of cool. This is the bat suit with the boxing gloves. I don't think it's very valuable. We'll put it up there because I don't really 100% remember. Uh, Kite Man or something to that effect. Here's uh, Riddler's cane. Goes with that fig, I think. Uh, <laughs> there's a bro. <laughs> totally bro status right there. 
Uh, we got Robin, another Batgirl right here. Superman in dark blue. We got the genie. Not much there. Riddler again. Here is another friend's fig, I think. Phoebe, I want to say. Something like that. Uh, ooh, Django Fett. Not cracked. Hello. Thank you very much. I will take that one. Uh, this one is Boomerang, I think. Research. There's one version that's good and one version that's not so good. I think that's the good one, but I'm not 100% sure. Owie. That one I wouldn't say is, uh, is, is worth selling again. I think that one's had its time. <laughs> I, I don't know. You guys can comment below if you think that one might have had its time, but I, I'm pretty sure it has. There's Bruce Wayne. That's a solid fig right there. Uh, Two-Face Head. Yep, I will use that as well with the hairpiece on there too. Uh, ooh, speaking of Inquisitor, here is some of the rest of the Inquisitor. Look at that. Look at that, the original Grand Inquisitor before the remade one. This is the original version of that. Uh, some solid hair, that actually is a rare hair piece, I believe. That goes to Dana Barrett, I think. I don't know who else it goes to, but I'll have to take a look. Uh, that is the Red Gamora. Red Gamora, I think that one's actually pretty good too. Uh, and we have Tony Stark here. Usable torso, change the arms out. Uh, there's an Ice Queen. We have Bib Fortuna's headpiece. Put that down there. Sometimes these uh, these little parts and pieces hauls can be kind of fun. Don't know what that one goes to. Probably a series fig. Not much there. Uh, we got to be careful with these things that we just scoot aside. Sometimes they're they're really good. Uh, nothing there. Nothing there. Could be some solid headpieces, but nothing really comes to mind. There's an old school Batman head. We'll definitely use that. Uh, there's a Joker, two bicycles, another Dick Grayson. That looks like a custom printed Arkham Asylum. Research. Research for later. That's a heck of a pew pew right there. Uh, we got Ray and Han Solo. There's a good piece. Star-Lord helmet. You can always use Star-Lord helmets. There are, I think, a couple versions of Star-Lord helmet. I always thought there was only one, but I think there are a couple versions of them. Uh, here's Dr. Quinzel. That's actually a cool fig. Put that one down there. Uh, we got Green Lantern. Hello there. 15 bucks. Just put some hair on him and he'll be good to go. That could be the Hogwarts uh, statue. Little penguin. Don't know how much that penguin is worth. Uh, those are custom <laughs> two-toned arms, so we're not going to do anything with those. Ooh, Beast Boy goes along with Starfire. Unfortunately, he does have a chew mark in the back and a crack, so hopefully we can change out his torso. His head might be a little divoted as well. Might have to just sell that one as is, unfortunately. Uh, I don't usually do that, but if it's a good fig, sometimes you can just get it, you know, sell it for cheaper, and people will be like, hey, I can actually afford that, and it's a figure I've always wanted, so sometimes they still pick it up. We'll see. We'll see. Oh, hello. Don't be damaged. Drax. We need some blue or red legs for him. Uh, I think the red pattern has red. I think this version has the red legs. Would make sense with that Gamora that we found. Fantastic find right there. 40 bucks or so uh, on that one. Nice, 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 nice. There's Lobster Batman. Uh, some mismatches. Frodo with Obi-Wan. This one might be Pepper Potts. It's cracked anyways, though, so we'll just put it over there. Uh, Harley Quinn Hammer. Those are always pretty fun. Nothing there. There's a uh, Poison Ivy. Itchy or scratchy. There's Krang. Uh, damaged Vader. Not bad. Ooh, there's a Special Forces. Hopefully the rest of Jack's set would be in here. That'd be kind of cool. That's a good one. That is the... Um, Clark Kent. Wow, I could not think of who Superman actually was. Spoiler alert. Oh, geez. <clears throat> Ruined his identity. Now I have to go apologize. That's actually a cool piece, too. It's a little worn, unfortunately, but that is an Atlantean Guard um, breastplate, which is actually pretty neat. <clears throat> oh, my gosh. My voice is going, going away. We got Bane there. Uh, I don't think that's what's supposed to be on that. There's a Qui-Gon Jinn. Is this going to be the... Oh, that would have been a good torso as well. Unfortunately, it's all beat up. Ooh, I was hoping it was that one. This is the Gungan sub, Queen Amidala version of the um, Qui-Gon Jinn right there. Nice. Uh, there's possibly a good Robin uh, Darth Maul. That's not bad either. Uh, this one's kind of cool. The red protocol droid from the Echo base. Ooh, look at that. You never know. Never know, Jackhead, we will use that, absolutely. I am short on those for sure, and I have a whole bunch of torsos and stuff like that that need to go on that, so 
Uh, here is the rest of Han Solo's legs. His body is probably in here and his hair as well. Uh, he's not super fantastic, but he's pretty good. Uh, another one of these hat or hair pieces for that poison ivy. ivy. That's pretty nice. Hopefully we have more pieces of that. I'll take all of those that I can. Um, I don't think that's the right torso for Pre Vizsla. Uh, I think that's just a... Let's see, let's compare it to a regular one. Oh, actually... That is Pre Vizsla right there. All right. Needs an arm, needs his cape, needs the helmet and the legs, but start of a Pre Vizsla. The start of a Pre Vizsla for sure. That's something. That is something. Uh, ooh, look at that green multicolored arm. That, I think the dark green arm for Robin is the one that's more expensive. Uh, I don't see him in here though. Uh, let's see, there's Harley Quinn. There is a cool mix of Anakin Palpatine right there. The old school version of Palpatine. That one actually could be what goes on this. I thought this was Maul, but well, I'm going to replace that torso anyways, but could be Palpatine. Papa Palp. Papa Palpy. Very possible. There's a custom again. Sweet little hat for our friend Penguin. Uh, this could be Pepper Potts as well. Her face. I think it is. Pretty sure it is. I'll put that down in the thing pile. This one is really, really good. That is the red hood. Oh, is it cracked? Hairline crack right there. Doesn't look like it's all the way through yet. Eh, it might be. Uh, red hood right there. That is a $40 figure if you can find him without cracks and everything. Probably still very valuable even with crack. Uh, it's not really super affecting him. There's an Alfred. I think he's supposed to have coattails, but I think that's a pretty good fig there as well. All sorts of good stuff in here. Uh, not sure why they... They were getting rid of it if they were a seller, but uh, I'm trying to remember what her name was. I totally don't remember. There's a Gamorrean, the detailed version of the Gamorrean. This is the old school version as well, which is more valuable than the new ones, of course, because you can get those still uh, in the store, which makes them not quite as useful as of yet. But probably in the future, unless they remake them again, uh, those ones will be pretty good too. Ooh, look at that. More pieces. More pieces. Ronin the Destroyer fantastic maybe i'll have to look for his head and stuff like that i could have thrown those to the side uh batman sometimes that happens there's a scarecrow pretty much every version of scarecrow is pretty good actually uh wonder woman we also have the scuba version of batman that's going to be in research i don't remember which of the suits are more valuable than others uh, unfortunately that was the old version of joker which is a fantastic head but it is a little bit beat up uh so that one's not going to be tremendous for us unfortunately uh, we have one of the officers. That could be pretty good. Uh, don't know what that is. Could be a friend's fig, possibly. Uh, not sure. Hermione. We got uh, Batgirl. Oh, there's Green Arrow. Just got to put a hood on him. He's got his bow right there. Uh, here's the gas mask Batman. That one's actually pretty cool as well, uh, I believe. Not sure how ting-worthy it is, but it's cool nonetheless, so we'll put it down there. Yeah, I think they were a lot of friends figs because I think that is Ross. Bat signal? Is that fake? That's real. Must be glow in the dark. Is it glow in the dark? It is glow in the dark. Can you see it? Can you see it? And... No, it's too light. I don't think you're gonna be... I scratched myself earlier. I actually got myself pretty good. <laughs> That's the bat signal, apparently. Uh, and apparently it glows in the dark. The more you know. Ooh, look at that. Ula. Ula headpiece. Uh, I have a whole bunch of headpieces and stuff. I need torsos for Ula. That's what I need the most of. Uncracked torsos, because I got a bunch of torsos that are cracked, unfortunately. Uh, there's Commissioner Gordon. I got a Joker there. That is a uh, Bounty Hunter headpiece. We'll use that, no problem. A lot of really good stuff in here. Very happy I picked this one up. Um, I won't have a problem with this one at all. Don't know who that is. Maybe that's a friend's fig as well. Uh, I think that's it. Chewy, head of the Mickey Mouse. Oh, this is a good piece too. That's part of Green Arrow. That's part that you don't want to lose either because that's a hard place, hard piece to replace the little hood right there. Good piece, good piece. Um, Well, there's the coffee cup from uh, for Rachel. Anyways, the rest is just kind of some parts and pieces. I don't see anything super fantastic. Uh, I'm sure I will go through this uh, in more detail and we'll probably find some more stuff. Uh, but for the moment, that looks like about it. Thank you very much for watching. Hopefully you guys had a good time. If you did hit that like button, I'd appreciate that very much. 
Um, I was hoping that that was the Darth Maul hips, but it is not. <laughs> womp womp. Uh, that's a bummer. Uh, anyways, if you had a good time, I would appreciate uh, hitting that like button. It spreads it to more people and more people can join the Leg Bros community. And uh, that's just all well and good. That is a Black Manta torso, I believe. That's fantastic. A lot of really good parts and pieces in this one. So I'm very, very happy. Hope you guys had some fun too. Love you guys. I'll catch you on the next one.